Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Yasin. Today I got my favorite tech product for the month of November 2017. I love November because it's my birthday and that's always exciting. So I can't wait to get this month started. And today we're gonna take a look at my favorite tech products for this month. But before we do that, let's take a look at the let's take a look at the winner from last month's episode, and that is Emma E. Garcia. Congratulations, Emma. I sent you out an email. Make sure you contact me back. We'll switch out some information and then I can send you out your prize to you. And um, today we're going to be looking at some awesome tech products that caught my eye this month. And remember, you can win any of these products. All you got to do is smash that like button letting me know that you like this episode. Uh, subscribe to my channel and leave a comment letting me know which product that you like. So if you do win, I will try to send you that product. There's also a link in the description that you can click on to get a few more entries to win so that you can increase your odds. But with all that said, let's take a look at some of the products that I have for you this month. So first we have Google Home Mini and um, last year the Google Home came out and that thing was about $130 but this one right here is going for 50 bucks so it's definitely a lot cheaper and it's definitely something that you can take a risk on it and see if you like it rather than spending $130 on one. I believe that one now dropped down to about 110 bucks. I'll leave a link in the description for the original Google uh, Home and uh, the Google Home Mini and basically the difference between the two products is that this one is a lot smaller and has uh, one speaker where the other one has got multiple speakers that are angled in different directions but the way I use it I use it in my bedroom and also in my kitchen so I'm not too far away from it whenever I'm using it but the fact that you can home automate everything is just awesome it makes you feel like you're Tony Stark from Iron Man and you can just say the hot word and then say play um, friends of uh, Netflix on my bedroom TV or turn on the fireplace or turn on the kitchen lights it's amazing. If you haven't tried it, I would definitely recommend that you try it. And I, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description where you can buy this guy and it's definitely worth a try. Up next, we have this awesome flash drive. So the reason I love this flash drive is that it can connect to a USB-C port on this side. That means you can connect it to a phone, to the new MacBook, uh, to the new MacBook Pros and use this just like a regular flash drive. But if you also have an older computer, then you can slide this little top piece right here and you can go ahead and connect this uh, USB port. And it's a USB 3.0 port, so it'll transfer your files really, really fast. And that's really handy for me and I love that because at work I have a PC that doesn't have USB-C and then at home I have my MacBook Pro which has USB-C and my phone is USB-C. So sometimes when I need to get files transferred from my work lap, uh, from my work PC to my MacBook, I just go ahead and use this and it's built really nice. It's made out of some type of metal on the bottom. I think it's aluminum and plastic on top, but it's also very, you know, rigid. You're not gonna break it or you're not gonna bend it. And you can just go ahead and attach a little string to the bottom right there and throw it into your keychain and you have 128 gigs flash drive at your disposal and you can also even load some movies or some uh, TV shows that you watch and go ahead and plug it into your phone for that long commute on the train or on the bus and watch it without filling up any of your space on your phone. So this guy is really handy. It's on Amazon. I believe it's going for 30 to $35. I'll leave a link in the description down below so you guys can definitely check this guy out. But this has been my go-to flash drive for the last month to month and a half. So cell phone cameras have been getting incredibly awesome. If you guys haven't seen my camera test between the iPhone 8 Plus and the Google Pixel XL, I'll leave that in the description down below so you guys can check that video out. I also did a blind eye test so that you can really see which camera phone that you like without knowing which picture was taken from which phone. It's definitely worth checking out. Make sure you do that. But with that in mind, with that in mind, that cell phone cameras are getting awesome then this next product is definitely something you should try to invest in it's a lens for cell phone cameras just like we have DSLRs and mirrorless cameras and we go ahead and buy lenses for them to take better pictures and make better videos it's the same concept you get you can get better lenses you can get macro lenses you can get wide angle lenses you can get telephoto telephoto lenses and this is a lens from Wolf Blitz. So this lens is pretty awesome. It's got a cover cap on the front and it's got a cap on the back. And basically how you connect it to your phone is that you go ahead and connect it to this little clip by twisting it on and it twists all the way. And then you take your phone. If I have my phone in my pocket, you take your phone like this and you go ahead and run it and, and line it up with the lens. So when you turn it on, 
you got the lens connected to your phone like this and you can take way better pictures like I said you can get zoom lenses you can get wide angle lenses and with camera phones getting so good honestly sometimes I see myself just carrying this lens right here and my cell phone and then using that rather than carrying my mirrorless camera around so I'm definitely starting to love these lenses and I'm going to just start collecting a bunch of these. So um, this has definitely been one of my favorite tech products for this month. So the next product on the list is this portable battery bank. And what I like about this portable battery bank is the fact that it's also wireless charging. So that means you can essentially take your phone without having to connect the cable and just put it right on it and it'll start charging your phone wirelessly. And wireless charging is definitely going to start taking off now that Apple took uh, wireless charging and put it in their phones with the iPhone 8, the 8 Plus, and the iPhone X. So I'm really excited and this is really one of my favorite portable battery banks. I have a ton of portable battery banks but I always go back to this one because it is uh, without the cable that's like one less thing to carry around with you. I can put this in my pocket, put my phone in my pocket and as long as both of them are touching each other my phone is charging while it's in my pocket without having to fiddle around with cables or without having to make sure that cable is connected. So this guy right here is definitely a handy little uh, portable battery bank portable solution and while you're charging your phone wirelessly you could also hook up a wire and help a buddy out or somebody else that's with you and have their phone charge as well so it's a really all-rounded probably the best portable battery bank out there right now that's why I love it and that's why it's my go-to battery bank and the last item that I have for my favorite tech product of the month is these cables these are cables from anchor and this is the anchor powerline plus uh, lineup basically and they come in all types of different colors they come in all types of different uh, kinds this one right here is a uh, micro USB this one is USB-C then uh, to regular USB and then we have USB-C to USB-C and then also um, lightning cable so I really like these uh, cables because one of first of all they're coming awesome colors um, why wouldn't you want to have a red cable or a blue cable and they're also braided so that means they are really really strong like I've seen YouTube videos of people trying to pull cars with these and they didn't even rip and I'm really careless about my cables um, I keep them in a good place but then when I'm using them I got them bent or going around my arm going around my neck under my pillow so I've had my share of cables break on me but these braided cables have not and these guys are like 10 to 12 dollars on Amazon I mean yes on Amazon and I'll leave a link in the description where you guys can buy them but I have a collection of all of these uh, in different colors so that I know what each color is for so if I need USB-C to USB-C I know that's the gray color if I need USB to USB-C then I know that's the red color and I keep all four of them in a little bag and I just pull out whatever I need and I got one plugged in my bedroom I got one plugged uh, in the office right here one plugged downstairs so definitely Definitely, these are cables that I would recommend and they have been my favorite cables to use for all my products and yeah go check them out so that was my favorite tech products for the month of November 2017 I hope you guys liked the video uh, if you guys have any questions about any of the products please let me know and you know what let me I just noticed that that drawer right there has been open the whole time there's nothing really in it, but that's funny because I'm out here doing my outro and I just noticed that. Anyway, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel. Share with all your friends. Uh, make sure you guys enter the giveaway. All you got to do is smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below letting me know which product that you guys like. And also check out the link, uh, the first link in the description so that you can get multiple ways, extra ways to win these products. And uh, good luck to, to you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, stay plugged.